Hello ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, the final in the speedrun game, chosen by Ron Gilbert, best known for his work on the first two Monkey Island games, and this game is by Truism, and it is Puss Puss Platypus. Alright, not, not fantastic transitions in between the scenes there, with the gap showing up at the bottom. Oh, is that Puss round the Platypus's mouth? Or is it where someone just sneezed all over him? Ah, so I believe the storyline of this game is, by the looks of things, the platypus seems to be, I don't know, drugged up or something. Oh, so if uh, best use, I need to use the Oculus Rift and make kissing sounds into the microphone. Well, sadly, I don't have a lot of money, okay, Truism? So fuck you! Can't use the Oculus Rift, you bastards. Uh, but if I hit tab, apparently it will switch between. There you go, that's Oculus Rift. And here's normal mode. So, just walking along, kissing things. I mean, it's kind of good I don't have the Oculus Rift, because if I did have the Oculus Rift, I'd need to make kissing sounds to get this to work properly, apparently. I mean, we could, we could make a whole video of DIE! DIE THROUGH KISSING! Fucking love you! Yes! <laughs> Even trees fall beneath my love! Oh god, I've really screwed that up. Whoa! Yeah. Oh god, what the hell is that? Oh, it's a cloud. That I've destroyed. Can I get crushed by the cloud? I love you, bunnies. Right, let's let's play a bit more tactically now. So yeah, this is our very last game that we're covering on the indie speedrun. So it's been a wild journey. Plus Plus Palapus was not a winner, but it was the f a finalist. Which is pretty good. Better to be a finalist than a final piss. Come back here, you fishy bastard. So, basically, I'm just going around spreading love by the looks of things. Ah, Look at those little... The the music, I know it's probably that I'm on drugs and I'm actually destroying everything here uh, from the intro sequence anyway, but the music is eerie considering I'm just walking down a path kissing things. Love you, hedgehog. I'm assuming that's a hedgehog. Oh, look, we've made it into town. What a glorious vista that awaits us. I love you, humans. I'm just a little platypus on my way to the platypus mall. Which is totally a thing. What do you think, Platypus Econom? Is he? And then we got some businessmen. Ah, uh, they're just helping me out with my Platypus economics. Oh, whoopsie! It seems that love has destroyed that lamp post. <laughs> oh, physics! Oh, there we go. This is more. More what I'd expect from this sort of game. Ah, oh, it's beautiful music. Everyone just loves being kissed by me. What can I say? I'm a, I'm a lover, not a fighter. Oh, it's a giant baby. That totally makes sense. Ah, oh, that. You see, I saved that fire truck from going into potholes there with the power of love. Octo plus. It's like a. Looks like he was wearing an Oculus, but he was an octopus. I see what they did there. So, gameplay wise, there's not too much here. <laughs> this is pretty much it. Unless it's going to suddenly surprise me. It looks like this is a destroy things simulator, really. With love. Giant babies. What's not to like about giant babies in the game? I think there are too few games without giant babies. Oh, ice cream. I've. Whoa! Whoa! What did I do there? Oh, it's an Octolus. Every time I see an Octolus from now on, I'm going to use the Oculus Rift mode. Um, for as long as, you know, before I can't kill them anymore. I mean, love them love the most so much. Oh, are we coming towards the end of our platypus journey? Whoa! <laughs> you drunk! Falling down over in the corner there. Oh, delicious 
brown Oreo. That's what I assume this is. And now, full on love assault. I love you. Okay, so I reached the crotch. Thank you for kissing. You kissed 72 out of 90. Lover. Cook. Visionaire. Let's look at this through Oculus Rift mode. Whoa. There's two of them. Crazy. Okay. Um. <laughs> it's safe to remove the Oculus Rift now. Okay, I'll remove my Oculus Rift. There you go. That was Pass Pass Platypus. Rather basic little title. Um, pretty. Pretty as hell. And functional. You can at least say that, unlike some of the other games in the Indie Speed Run, because they only have 48 hours. But I do assume that is the storyline. You're actually a platypus killing a load of things, but you're like high or something and you're kissing them instead. Anyway, that has been our final Indie Speed Run game. So if you have enjoyed, do please like, share, subscribe, and also go check out the game on the Indie Speed Run run website see if you can beat my score why not you probably can because i wasn't really giving it my all that's going to be my excuse and if you have an oculus rift try it out with that if you don't if you do have an oculus rift fuck you um and you can send it to the six gamers at any point you're probably not going to do it now that i've told you to fuck yourself but yeah so bye guys <laughs>